too much as you can see we are both uncombed he looks better than i do because he's at least in clothes i'm still in my pajamas um today i'm alone my help is running late she did tell me she was i don't even know if she should come you know because she lives so far away it's like by the time she gets here it's probably like 11 o'clock and then we've got swimming today um swimming yeah we're going swimming babe we got swimming today to make up for a lesson that we missed and then we're gonna we need to leave here at like three o'clock and because of load shedding which we currently have right now i had to hustle to make his food and mine right. for breakfast to make sure that oh hold on hold on hold let go please. i had to hustle to make his breakfast and um and mine hi and hi now we are without electricity hi. for the next two and a half hi. hours hi hi ah. 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 you're so cute <laughs> you are uh -oh. yes kind you are kind yes i am what are you i, I am jump jump you are what jump jump loved i don't know what that is jump i am jump jump what does that mean tom you are tom no you're not tom you are zion We've been trying to do affirmations every now and then and sometimes he listens and actually repeats them. Sometimes he says all done. Um, but yeah, I want to go and change our bedding and I've got a stash of nappies on the other side of this room that needs to be stuffed. And then I've got so linen, nappies, dishes, um... What else? I don't know if I should leave the cleaning to her. Oh, I need to shower. I mean, when I'm alone. Zai Zai? Can you hold on a little bit, please? Thank you. When I'm alone, I take Zion to the shower with me. to show you that zion is being helpful or at least trying he sees that something is going on with the laundry so he's unpacking all the clean laundry and putting it on the bed and now he's putting it back can we put it back please please thank you should i help you oh you got this hey no, it needs to be back in here, not back on the bed. Zion, no, babe. Oh my gosh. That took so long. I need to shower now, and I thought that my helper would be here by now. She's not here at the store. Um, I need to shower. I need to put Zion in the shower with me, not like inside the shower, but in the bathroom with me while I shower, because otherwise he does this, and then he's gonna fall off the bed, and then I'm gonna go to jail. Okay. So while I'm showering, Zion does this. He unpacks this cupboard this one and i don't mind because i watch him from the shower over there and he brings some of them to the door for me how sweet and puts them down and he says thank you and he puts them down here 
And then after I shower, I have to pick them up, which is fine. I put all the things that I don't want him to touch inside the sink. <laughs> and then I just put them back in here when I'm done showering, which is what I'm gonna do now. Dressed. I did my brows just a little bit, no other makeup. My skin has just been like, oh, you know, since I did my skin routine, do you all remember that? It's just been horrible. Like, here's okay, the hyperpigmentation is still not there, but like pimples here, here. I feel like there's another one coming this side. And I'm gonna say the only thing that's changed in my life is the fact that I'm on medication. So I'm gonna blame that because there's no other reason for me to be having pimples. Sion is having a little bit of milk. <clears throat> I bend the rules a little bit when I'm alone because I'm not trying to have a tantruming baby. He usually. Why must there be a truck going past? He usually only has two bottles, one in the morning, one in the evening. But when I'm alone with him, I bend the rules to make my life easier because that's all we need. I wanted to show you my outfit of the day. It's so cute. <clears throat> okay, so, um, can't, I don't know if you can see all of it. Can't see from the viewfinder. But these little tracksuit pants, this top I think was thrifted, but it was also my brother's. And this is a bodysuit from Zara. These pants I got from factory and my little Birkenstocks. I love it so much. So cute. And I put earrings on today. For me, I feel like getting dressed, it helps me like mentally. I'm ready for the day, ready to tackle the day. Not wearing my ring today, as you can see, because I've got things to do around the house. And I also feel like, because I take it off when I go to the gym when I'm doing weights. If I'm doing cardio, then I'll keep it on. But I feel like I want one of those silicone rings. Um, I think it's called a free form ring. I don't know. I'll check just now. The electricity just came back, so I'll be able to check, see if I can find one, um, so that I don't have to be taking my ring on and off. And then I can just put my ring on when I go to like, I don't know, a restaurant or something, but I can have my ring in a silicone form. Do you know what I mean? Because I don't want to take it off. But like lifting with it also is like no no no. Um, but yeah, getting dressed. There's this lady I follow on TikTok. Her name is her handle on TikTok is Rosa because her name's Rosie, and <clears throat> she does this thing where here comes Zion. Come, don't touch. Okay. She does this thing where she gets up like an hour before her kid. She's currently also pregnant, oh, no. and no. she gets ready and no. like. You know, she's got like a routine, like a structure. I think it's called... Tractor. Yes, structure. Tractor. Not a tractor, <laughs> a structure. And it's super helpful and I wanted to start doing it. Oh. And oh. Oh. Yeah, just don't move my tripod, please. And I think that might come into play next year. I don't want to like overload myself with stuff right now because I'm like struggling to keep up, you know, with life. Keep up. Um, so I think that might come into play next year, but also I just think to myself, uh, uh, Zion, I just think to myself after I drop Zion off at school, which brings me to the next point. <gasps> after I drop Zion off at school, I'm probably gonna go to the gym and then come home. So I won't get dressed until like after nine o'clock, which is also like what I currently do right now. Please excuse my child. Um, but speaking of school, I enrolled him into school yesterday. <gasps> going to school next year yes yes and it's good for everybody it's gonna be so good for everybody it's gonna be good for me to be working full-time okay. and you know not be worrying because like right now to on days like today when I don't have help I don't have to worry that I have to look after Zion I can just continue working um, I'm going to be focusing a lot on my baking business next year, which is definitely what I want to do. And yeah, I'm nervous because he starts literally on the 12th of Jan as I on. And that means we've got like two months together. And by the way, he turns 20 months today. Today is the 10th of November. He turns 20 months old. Mount. Yes. And in four months time, he's going to be two. You're gonna be two years old. How old are you gonna be? Two. No. Say two. Two. Yes. 
He already looks like such a big kid. Hey, are you a big kid? Big kid. <laughs> yes, Zion is a big kid. Big kid. Yes. Big so kid. Oh God. I literally did not plan to be crying. It's just gonna sit down. You know, I've got this mountain of freaking nappies over here to stuff. And I thought we'd just catch up. And then I opened TikTok and there was a video about suicide awareness. And then now it got me all messed up. I'm not gonna say the word. I will write a thing here and I'm just gonna say SI when I talk about that. And that wasn't what I was planning to talk about. I was just planning to talk about how I am. And this is with this girl sister and alived herself and this one that i saw on tiktok like i'll be crying and she it's been a year since her sister and alive herself and she's like hey um it's been a year since you've been gone um i thought i'd catch you up on the things that you've missed and you know she's not telling you know, simple things simple things like they went to disney her her brother mother their dad moved to arizona he has a pool now her cat the girl that unlocked herself's cat her cat um sits at her window and sometimes sits in her empty seat at the dinner table and i just thought to myself like that's so sad And then, what did I see the other day? Um, I was listening to the podcast, My Only Story. And it was about the boy who unalived himself as well from St. Andrew's College in Grahamstown. And I think somebody on TikTok said this, like, nobody really wants to, yeah, in, the, in a comment section of a video about SI yes it was a video about SI nobody really wants to unalive themselves they just really want to get out of the situation that they're in and they think that there's no other way than to unalive themselves and I just thought I can relate <laughs> I don't want to unalive myself I have thought about it because I just thought <sighs> there's no ways I can get out of the situation that I'm in This was supposed to be a happy vlog. This was supposed to be a day in the life, just cleaning, just going about my business. And well, no, it's not. <laughs> I literally, you know, the only thing that keeps me going is seeing Zion's little. And hearing him say uh, yesterday he woke up and he started calling me mommy mommy and I'm just like this is this is the only reason I will stay alive is me you say mommy until you're freaking 40 child <sighs> okay yeah <clears throat> I mean, I made this TikTok the other day that, I don't know if you've heard that sound, but it's like, hey, I don't know what the girl's name is, but I'm just gonna use my name. Hey, Dee, where you been? We ain't seen you in a... And she's like, I'm drowning in bills. And I'm just like, I'm drowning in depression. You're not gonna see me. You're not gonna see me outside. You're not gonna, if you don't have my number, you're not gonna see me on Instagram. You're not, okay? I sit behind my computer. I schedule my posts. 
you're not gonna see me on stories okay you're not so if you don't have my number and you and I mean if you have my number and you consider yourself my friend and you haven't made plans and whatever then you're not gonna see me right I've shifted these videos so many times the videos the vlogs that I've made I've moved them the, the one was supposed to go out this weekend on a Sunday I think it's the 14th yeah and <clears throat> I moved it to next week Wednesday and now I don't know if I'm gonna put it out next week Wednesday I will move them and move them until I feel like you know what I can put this out yeah anyways let me fold these napkins and stop crying <laughs> I'm done with the nappies. I need to go downstairs to my car and get something. And I don't feel like it, but it's actually urgent. My oven is bust and I just can't get a freaking replacement element. I have to like order it and like windy windy things, you know? Like being around the bush things, not just go in the shop, get it, get an electrician, install it, have a working oven, bake beautiful cakes, taste beautiful flavor. Ugh. Then lo oh, the reason it broke is because of load shedding. So it's just like I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Um, no, I don't. Zero. You know, living in South Africa, don't recommend. Zero out of ten. But I can't pack these away because I'm still snapping. Um, I've got my laptop open. That's why I keep looking this way. But let me go downstairs and get the piece of paper. I need to email the people. The model number for the oven so that they can order the element but also i'm just like should i not go to macro but they're probably going to tell me the same thing because they don't just store these elements i mean you know, i'm not going to go to macro i'm just going to email people because i don't like why oh, must i drive <laughs> scared of <laughs> scared of driving especially when there's no freaking electricity on the and the traffic lights are not working okay Got it. I need to start working. It's a bit hot, eh? <laughs> Take this off. <laughs> and my pants are very warm. But I'm gonna change into a swimming costume. I think I'm just gonna wear a cover up. Yeah. We just got to swimming we're literally like a whole 20 minutes early which never happens and it ma makes me a little bit anxious like mm. because then i have to wait in the car with this little guy and then i'm like oh my gosh is he gonna get hungry is he gonna get thirsty i do bring him a snack but he has it after swimming is he gonna get thirsty is he gonna be annoyed um am i gonna change him in time because i took a different route because the route that we usually take to swimming takes us literally 40 minutes and we do not live 40 minutes away from the swimming school and i took a back route which was so quick so i think i'm gonna do that every friday because today's a makeup lesson and then we're gonna come back again on friday little kids he's kicking me we're gonna come back on Hi. friday again um and yeah let's let's get this guy into his costume Who's little feet? Oh, you wait. Taking a risk here, yeah, boy. Right. A risk. We are home and try to find good lighting. There we go. Um, we're home, showered or bath. Zion and I had a bath together. And then 
his dad got him dressed he's going to sleep now he just had a bottle of milk so Mbure, can you please brush his teeth i did brush his teeth this morning just okay. fyi um i i need to end this vlog but before i do that i've got to go to zion's room and get things out of his compactum because i need to put new clothes in his compactum um what are you doing zion on my phone thank you Oh no. oh no oh no oh no phone no phone oh, so no. i'm gonna go to his room and get stuff out of his compactum because i got him new onesies that are very very cute i didn't do a, a haul because i didn't buy like a huge bunch of clothing um so yeah let me go to his room it's dark there we go and i'm gonna take these clothes out Can we say good night? Say good night. <laughs> bye bye vlog. Oh, cute. Can I get a kiss? Mommy, get a kiss. Mommy, not the vlog. Can mommy get a kiss? Bye vlog. Bye vlog. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. See you next time. <laughs>